Hey everyone, and welcome to Talk Daily. My name is Eddie, and today we're going to be talking about the Koenigsegg Jesko. And it's a thing. If this machine is a thing, it's a $3 million machine. And uh, before you say anything, it's all sold out. Sorry, there's none available for you. So sorry. They only made 125. There weren't only 125 worldwide. This is a super hyper 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 super super car i mean it's a uh it's a machine to behold and here's some photos of it um i mean before any further this uh, obviously uh, comes to me uh, courtesy of uh, car and driver and mr eric stafford is the writer of this current article um look at the design i mean it looks like a mclaren in the rear it's just this car if you don't know it's all about aerodynamic it's capable of generating so much downforce so much downforce meant to hug the road and uh, i doubt any of these cars are going to be taken to the track and be smashed around but hey you know anytime you say all you know there's gonna be an exception right so i don't know how many people are going to take this to the track and mash it around but i believe this is directly going to the collector box directly cars and coffee and collector box but it's beautiful if you see one on the road uh um take a picture man because it's uh you know you see a lot of these out there um it's a beautiful machine um there's nothing really i, I don't see anything to fault it uh, you can't really go on the pricing of these vehicles and fault them okay so i'm gonna read a little bit about the article is talking about the price i mean i like the fact that the pricing which one to buy it's just they're being silly uh koenigsegg jesco is offered in two flavors base model built for road use and a track only variant yeah base model come with all treat hypercar buyers expect the car boosts a forged aluminum wheels and a staggered setup with a 20 inch up front and 21 in the back all model comes with rear wheel steering which helps the car deliver faster cornering improve maneuver maneuverability and better steering feel a front spiller rear diffuser and a massive wing are on hand to maximize downforce and minimize drag the car also features brand auto skin function first seen a koenigsegg regera that opens every body panel with the press of a button the jesco is equipped with the dihydral doors and the uh, auto skin system uses sensors to prevent those doors from opening in situation where are faced with an obstruction yeah you don't want the door to come out and hit you only 125 as we said uh, are um, slated for production Koenigsegg report all these cars already have been sold so they're making them and already been sold I mean that is how to run a company that's exactly how to run a company you already have your profit you're you're done the cycle is done it's just hi right, guys just make them when you have time I mean I'm pretty sure they're working hard to release all these model but it's it's a testimony of Koenigsegg um record breaking and they're always on the cusp right that was breaking record with speed downforce handling i mean they are the machine they are, they are the machine to beat uh moving along engine transmission and performance so koenigsegg jesco is motivated <laughs> motivated i love the writing by a twin turbocharged 5.0 liter v8 generating 1000 280 horsepower and 1106 for pound of torque on pump gas on e85 the output jumps to 1600 horsepower koenigsegg claims that the engine features the world lightest v8 crankshaft weighing at mere 28 pounds for the crankshaft the crankshaft is crafted from a single solid steel billet and its flat plate layout facilitate even firing across the engine banks. Design all set up the stage of a rich, uh, memorable engine note. Too bad we don't have a clip of that. This Swedish hypercar comes with an innovative 9-speed gearbox, referred to as a light-speed transmission. <laughs> light-speed transmission. Built by Koenigsegg, the LST features a multi-clutch design that according to the company provide quicker gear shift compared with dual clutch. All model comes with a rear, rear wheel steering system that heighten performance. At high speed, the system turns the rear wheel in the same direction at the front to improve cornering and boostability. At low speed, it orient, ba orient the back wheel sort of opposite direction as the front to give the car a faster turn in. Relative to Agero RS, the Jetsco offers 40% increase in downforce. Yep. Koenigsegg said that the Jetsco can produce 170, one, excuse me, 1764 pounds of downforce at 155 miles an hour 
and as much as 3,086 pounds at higher speed. That's almost as much the car claims, 3,131 pound curb weight. Uh, man. And he goes, in interior comfort and cargo, leave it to your imagination, amount of cargo. No, you're not going to go do your um, grocery shopping in this vehicle. Or you could if you don't have a passenger. But anyway, the, but if you have it and that's what you want to do, hey, man, more power to you. Uh, the Koenigsegg Jetsco seats two passenger and comes with a detachable hardtop that allows you to enjoy open air driving. Power windows, adjustable pedal, and adjustable steering column are among the standard fare. The car auto skin system provide electro hydraulic operation of body panel, high end materials such as leather, carbon fiber, and aluminum. Aluminium are generously used throughout the cabin, giving the interior a swank look. Um, I don't know. What that, I, don't, I don't even know what that means. Okay. Uh, Again, if you're buying this car because the comfort creature inside, I, I don't even think these people are going to drive these cars. 125 worldwide? Nah, I don't know who buys it, but they probably might drive it a little bit, but I, I don't see like they're really buying this for their comfort. You probably have a bunch of other cars. Anyway, it just has uh, two dedicated uh, compartments, one up front. I don't know, I keep talking about compartments. To get a data provide roughly five cubic feet of cargo space. Ooh. Infotainment connectivity. Okay, it comes with infotainment, some kind of a car, uh, Apple CarPlay. That's not the point. Um, I think the point is if, how did he get it? You know, and uh, what? You go just Koenigsegg and you sign up, you write him a check, like, yeah, go ahead. I want it. I, whatever. I mean, it's, uh, to me, it, it, it's amazing. This car has, I don't think it has anything electric. It's just literally just a V8, old school V8 doing what it does best. Um, it's a beautiful machine. Uh, so anyway, I just want to bring to your attention the Jesco, Koenigsegg Jesco, if you know about it. And um, it's sold out. Uh, too bad, everybody. It's sold out. But if you own one and you know someone who owns one, hey, uh, let us know in the comment below. And uh, uh, man, if you, um, you ever see one, take a picture. I mean, I bet these are rare. 125 is not a lot worldwide. It's not a lot. It'll be interesting to see the demographics of where these cars are going. And hopefully the owners, uh, if, you know, hopefully they take them out and uh, show them to the public once in a while. Uh, I would imagine most of these cars will be in um, uh, carefully airtight, purified air compartment <laughs> garage area. Um, yeah, I don't think these cars are going to be, uh, uh, I'm, I'm not being negative, but I don't I don't think these cars are going to be, you're not going to see this car doing, um, you know, Nürburgring um Maybe one guy, but I, I don't uh, I don't see that with 125 production. Mm. But hey, if if you see it um, again, as I said, uh, enjoy it because uh, not a lot of us gonna be able to see this car. Anyways, um, good job, Koenigsegg. Uh, again, they're it's a fascinating company. They have very high quality control and they manufacture some fascinating cars. They they they're doing their own thing. They're doing their own thing. They're, they're independent of all the other hypercars, and they're. Their mission seems to always be on the cusp, on the edge of speed. And they're doing a fantastic job at it. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. My name is Eddie. Uh, if you like this uh, clip or you like the other material, please uh, do like and subscribe. And let us know what you think in the comments below. Again, the link to this article will be in the description below. Thanks for watching. As always, take care. And I'll see you next time.